Now to tonight's big story at 10, a new program in consideration to help hundreds of Fox Valley employees find a much needed ride to work. A key vote on Wednesday would allow the Fox City's Transit Commission a new bus route through a park near the Nina Business Park. Those in favor say the move would open the door to job opportunities. NBC 26's Billy Wagness is live in Appleton with that story. Holly, manufacturers in the industrial park have been raising this issue for years as it stands now. City leaders say that the nearest bus stop to one section of the park is about a mile away. To get to Menasha Corporation's work site from that bus stop, you have to walk down this frontage road with no sidewalk. Fox Valley Workforce Development Board CEO Paul Stelter says it's a discouraging challenge for potential employees. In some cases, we're hearing that people uh, have to exclude that as a possibility for employment because they don't have ready transportation. The challenge has led to an idea, a six-month pilot program starting in July, extending Valley Transit's bus service to the park free for riders. Making it far easier for people who are either looking to work there or already working there to be able to get to work. Valley Transit already does more than one million trips a year. 50% of those are for jobs. This service is exactly what we look to do. The pilot route would operate according to employer shifts. The service would also be contracted out to Cobus and Buses, a private contractor for now. So that way we can see how it works, see how it fits in with the funding, tweak it as we need to. If popular, the route could become permanent. Now, if approved Wednesday, interested companies would spend roughly $24,000 for the six-month trial. And Volsky says over $31,000 would also be matched on a state and federal level. Live in Appleton, Billy Wagness, NBC26.